BPI has said, the strength of banks' balance sheets was evident in their ability to respond to the demand for credit at the onset of the pandemic. This is not true. The COVID-19 pandemic did not prove that banks were a source of strength. Instead, the scope and scale of U.S. government's fiscal policy and unprecedented actions taken by the Fed to support financial markets served as a backdoor bailout of the banking system during the pandemic. Without those trillions of dollars to support the financial system and economy, numerous banks would undoubtedly have failed, almost certainly causing a financial crash. The banks and their advocates consistently fail to mention the trillions of dollars they received throughout the COVID-19 pandemic from the Fed and taxpayers. This support was so massive that it not only prevented bank losses and failures, but it also led to increased bank earnings. This once again proves that banks aren't prepared for a financial crisis. They are relying on you, the taxpayers, to bail them out while they continue to collect record bonuses. That's why they need to have more capital. They should have to pay for their own losses, not shift them to the taxpayers. <laughs>